Okay, fans, today we're here with Shane. What's up, guys? At Rock and Brews, and we're gonna get to know him a little bit better outside of soccer, so we're gonna hit the batting cages and do some mini golf, so let's go have some fun. Time to choose your weapon. Grab one, we'll start with this one. I feel like you're setting me up for failure. Oh yeah, okay. Is that it? Yeah, I'm sure. That's the winner? Right, I'm going with green. Green, all right, ready? Might be a little rusty here. <laughs> yeah, okay. Do you golf a little bit. What got you into golf? My dad did. Probably once I was like five, five to eight. No way. Oh my God. We got a battle. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, I lied when I said I don't golf. I also did this first tee thing, so I think Tiger Woods kind of started it for inner city kids, but I would just go and they teach you how to putt and chip. So what about you? Do you play any sports? Did ballet and dance full time. Oh, nice. I did a little ballet. Did you? My mom put me in when I was like three, maybe? I don't know. A long time ago, I was in the peanut cracker. The nut cracker. Wait. Yeah, I said it and it didn't sound right. <laughs> Listen, there's a lot of footwork and skills to be learned. Yeah, for sure. It's not easy. Uh-oh. No way. Oh. Wow. Unlucky. What other sports did you play growing up other than soccer? Football, basketball, baseball. Around eighth grade, I kind of just realized that I could probably take soccer the furthest. My dad played baseball in college, so he always wanted somebody to be playing baseball as they got older, but never really got it. I'm guessing you're a big LeBron guy. I am. One of the greatest athletes to ever live. Also from Akron, so my hometown. Backboard. Are your parents still there? Yeah. They're still in Akron. They've been there for, since about like 2000, so 22, 23 years. I was born in San Diego and then moved to Akron when I was five. Get in. Who on the team is the funniest? I like Matt LaGrosse's humor. He just got good banter. I think Jack's always getting involved as well. If you were not a professional athlete, what would Shane do? I don't know. Maybe I'd probably be in sales, I think. Really? Yeah. I can see you as a salesperson. Yeah. I don't know. My, my dad's been in sales for 25-ish years or so, maybe a little bit longer. But, well, medical device sales. You never know how much longer you're going to be playing, so there's got to be a backup plan eventually. Okay, just wrapped up mini golf. Shane, how do you think we did? I think we did pretty well. We don't have an official score yet. I think I won. I think Shane should stick to soccer. Ego check. <laughs> just kidding. It was a great time. Now we're gonna go hit the batting cages. Yeah, let's do it. All right, so you're going in the fast? Yeah. I'm gonna go in the slow. All right. Here you go. Thank you, thank you. See you in there. Here we go! Let's see this, Shane. Foul. Who were your uh, favorite baseball players? Coco Chris. Okay. Grady Sizemore. <sighs> Indians players. Or Guardians now, I guess. All right, let's see what you got. I'm a little nervous. Nice, let's go. When's the last time you Swing a bat. Years. That softball side still in you. It never went away. How fast do you think those pitches are? I'm feeling that 40 tomorrow. or 50 miles an hour. Oh, that's it. All right, we just wrapped up here in the batting cages. Shane, thank you for hanging out with me. It was yeah. fun getting to know you. Thanks for having me. I had a great time. Thanks for hanging out off the pitch. Stay tuned for the next episode. You ready to go? Let's do it. Let's go.